in the year 2038. In the developed world, stringent regulations are put in place to protect the natural world's resources. These regulations make it impossible to exploit new land for mining, farming, or manufacturing. In the face of these regulations, efforts turn to improving the efficiency of existing assets, and this gives rise to the extensive use of 3D printing and deprinting, the ability to disassemble finished goods and reuse their materials and printers to create new products. Given the constraints on materials and energy, knowledge of customer wants and needs becomes critical, and companies spend large amounts of time and money mining massive data sets. Managers turn to extensive use of simulation to maximize resources as well as software to efficiently manage projects. As access to natural resources becomes constrained in developed countries, Africa's unleveraged farmland, minerals, and fossil fuels become a critical world resource. Unsaddled by legacy power grids and factories, Africa leapfrogs the West in development of the new manufacturing economy. Massively open online courseware allows African students to excel in the sciences by having access to the best educators in the world at virtually zero cost. A new generation of highly educated Africans self-organizes in Accra, Ghana, and by 2038 the network of skilled labor, money from natural resources, and companies unencumbered by high manufacturing assets has created the equivalent of Silicon Valley, but moving at twice the speed. This signals a shift from permanent employees to renting capabilities as needed. Managers work with large, guild-like talent pools to source the right expertise in this fast-growing market. To respond to rapidly evolving customer needs in this growing market, the value proposition for research moves toward the fast identification of customer needs. The results are accelerated concept-to-market projects. This scenario is just a short 25 years away. How does this impact us today? Go to IRI's website to explore this and other scenarios in more depth, learn about implications for research and technology management, and view more products from the IRI 2038 project.